Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek. Today, what you see on my screen is what I'm going to teach you how to make a breakdown design inside of Canva. So, open Canva and let's start designing. And I think before we even get into the whole designing and stuff inside of Canva, look, did you know I know how to dance? Did you know? If you didn't know, look, just take a look at this video. Yeah, so you know now I prove it to you, right? So now you know I can dance. So if I start doing certain things, you understand a lot. I ain't joking no more. Okay, so now with all of these dance moves, let's translate it into Canva design <laughs> or into a Canva design. Okay, so yeah. Okay, so this is what we are going to do. So click on add a new page, and the background is black, okay, or black, which is zero 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 six zeros okay then the next thing we are going to do is you know, it's very simple so come into photos in photos um just search for you know male hip-hop dancer in studio that's all you need click on it and add it all right okay so you can see how everything is looking at the moment so let me just crop this to something like this then duplicate it position it right on top come to edit image and what you only need to do is to select the background remover so click on background remover and while canva is removing the background of our image i want to use this opportunity to tell you about some few interesting things the first thing is canva pro so just in case you are looking at doing more inside of canva when it comes to removing background images publishing canva designs directly from canva to any social media platforms adding multiple brand kits uploading custom fonts having more animation options when it comes to working with teams or larger teams inside of canva all of this is possible so i have a link in the description box below that can help you use canva pro for free so kindly check it out and start using canva pro today the next thing i want to talk to you about is the 60 photo descriptions ebook i have created for you this contains 60 descriptions you can just copy and paste into canva and find high quality images inside of canva and the last thing is i've also upgraded my assorted canva templates from 20 to 65 templates so now you have more templates you can actually use for anything at all you want so all these links can be found in the description box below all right so the background of our photo had been removed and all we just have to do next is to press l on our keyboard for a line okay so once you have the line you can increase it okay and make sure you know it's a straight line okay so i'll position this here and let me zoom in a bit okay and just in case you want to adjust the line without you know tilting it press and hold shift while you you know move it okay and we'll just come here okay to line style and we'll increase the weight so to something like this should be fine you understand then the next thing is duplicate this line and rotate it to 90 degrees okay okay once you have 90 degrees move it here and also duplicate the line and move it also here so you see what we've been able to do so select all of them and group them okay so no not duplicate but rather group ctrl g so let me just do all of that again so select and hold shift okay and ctrl g then i'll just right click and send backward okay so you can see what is happening over here okay so i think this is beautiful and i'm loving it one thing you can do if you're on canva pro is you can duplicate this okay no instead of me just explain the whole thing let me rather show you okay look duplicate this um, line thing we created add a new page okay then you know move it over here okay and this is if you are on canva pro if you are not on canva pro i'll show you what you need to do so just come um here to download okay click on download and choose transparent background okay and we are just going to download just this page alone so i'll click on download and um, it should download quickly for us it should download in my um, downloads folder i should just go in there quickly okay so now i'll just come to upload and i'll come to upload files and i'll choose you know the line i uploaded okay so i should be able to find it here inside of canva okay so i will delete this select it and place it here if you are on the free version of canva go to the elements.theafricangate.com and search for three lines or or just search for line you should be able to see this download it upload it in canva and continue with whatever i'm about to show you okay so what you just have to do is we have to make sure everything is you know looking good so increase the size and um, you, you see what we are trying to do so it shouldn't be too big okay but it should look um, good okay then position it here and we'll just have to make sure everything is aligned and i'll do the same here then i'll just move it to the top so you can see how it's looking okay and make sure you also send it behind come to edit image choose 
shadows okay in shadow choose glow for that okay and all we are going to do is we are going to you know adjust this to a blue okay then we can increase the blur and also increase the size so depending on how you want it to look and you can also increase the transparency so click on apply okay and allow canva to save your design so it's not saved yet that's why it's looking small at the moment okay so while we wait for canva to save this we'll just continue with oh uh, okay i think it's saved now it's saved now so maybe increase the size okay and um just make sure you are selecting this is a bit tricky but you know we'll just have to get it done at all cost okay so it's just a matter of you trying to align you know things nicely over here okay and i'll move this over here to the top and i'll just send it you know yeah so you can see how this is looking at the moment i think it's looking um beautiful yeah i think this is actually looking very beautiful so i would press r on my keyboard okay for a shape choose black because this is a shape i just want to cover this all up then come to uploads and uh, if you are new to my tutorials go to the element of africangigs.com and search for gradient okay so search for gradient download it and um, i'll just show you what we are going to do so i'll just you know scroll all the way down choose it and place it directly on top over here okay then duplicate it and move it to the top so you see how the whole thing is looking right now then press t on the keyboard to add your text increase the size come over here and choose care k-a-r-e that's the name of the text okay so our position is over here and i said crazy so all i'm just going to do to search for or to type no crazy i don't know why i'm just rushing <laughs> okay then increase the size to something like this all right then move it to the top and um the next thing i'm just going to do is i'll duplicate this and just say friday okay so f r i d y select all and we'll also change it to um jonathan okay yeah i think there should also be a font called benjamin yeah <laughs> okay so now that we have all of this um we'll just add a special effect to this very soon but before that i just want to add all of this text over here because it's something i wouldn't want to spend time doing because i know you know how to add uh, text to your design okay so i just paste it over here okay and i'll just copy this line come back here and then um, paste it over here okay so now that we've been able to do all of that let's now focus on applying this interesting um you know effect to this so duplicate it okay and position it right on top come to effect choose um neon okay and uh, with the neon come to the text color and change the color to you know the same blue color we use then send it behind the original text and you can see how it's look so we are going to do the same for friday so duplicate friday okay position it here and um, do the same so come to effect come to neon select it come to the text color and choose the blue for red then you also send it behind you know the original text and this is what we have been able to do inside of canva and i hope you found this tutorial helpful if you want more canva tutorials check my channel make sure to like this video to support the video if you are new smash the subscribe button the name is benjamin always remember there is no limit to creativity i should see you in my next video